how to work with the four quadrants on graphs in 94 seconds. Let's go. When it comes to working with graphs, guys, it's going to be super important to recognize that we have four distinct quadrants. We have the positive positive quadrant in the top right, the negative positive quadrant in the top left, the negative negative quadrant in the bottom left, and the positive negative quadrant in the bottom right. Now, how can we use that information to plot these four points? What do we reckon? First of all, plotting on the coordinate for three, we have a positive value of X and a positive value of Y. So this is gonna go in the positive positive quadrant. We're gonna go along the cor corridor to four and up the stairs to three, we have the point four three. Now, what about our next coordinate here, which is going to be three negative two, three negative two. This time we have a positive value of X and a negative value of Y, so we're gonna be in in the positive negative quadrant, we're going to go along the corridor to three and down the stairs to minus two. That is going to lead us to this point here. We have the point three minus two. Next up, what are we going to have? We're going to have the point minus one five. Where's it going to go? This time we have a negative value of X and a positive value of Y. So we're going to go to the negative X di or we're going to go in the negative X direction and in the positive Y direction over to minus one five. That is going to be up here, minus one at five. And finally, what are we going to have? We're going to have minus four minus one. This time we're in the negative negative quadrant a negative value of X and a negative value of Y along the corridor to minus four, down the stairs to minus one, and we have the point down here, minus four, minus one. Let me write that one in there. We have minus one, minus four, minus one, I should say, as our point, guys. And that is gonna be how we work with coordinates in the four quadrants.